dynamic East Milton Square is the location for this fantastic one bedroom craftsman inspired cottage. Welcome to 50 Bassett Street. There's a lot to take in on this renovation opportunity. What an incredible spot. If you can live tiny or have the resources to add a second floor and expand, this is a really hard to beat location. This four room bungalow has made the owner so happy for 32 years and now it's your turn. Look at these original fur floors. Oh, I love the detail. Eight foot ceilings, what? All the double hung windows, Harvey replacements. There has been work done. The roof was done in 2009, is in good shape. Here's your primary bedroom in the back. Two windows, cross ventilation, lots of privacy. You're gonna see the owner really love to garden. Horsehair plaster walls, you know what that means. Gotta be gingerly here. Look at the detail in this bathroom. This is a mud job. Absolutely was spectacular in its day, but no exhaust fan. Look what happens. Oh, I told you horsehair plaster. Oh, what a mess. Look at that beautiful detail. I love that. Even the grate was so nicely made in this 1920 bungalow. Yeah, those are nine by nine tiles. They're newer. I don't think we need to worry, but you're gonna use your best decision making on that one. So it's an efficiency kitchen, but look, it's bigger than you would think. There is room for a little cafe table. There was one here when I got here. Opens right to the outdoors. Nice, through your side entrance. No dishwasher, nothing fancy, but you have room to improve. There's a pantry. There's, that's a picture window. That one hasn't been replaced. That's your side entry. All right, this stairway, oh my word, this is really something. Haven't seen this before. This ladder in the basement stairway that's your creaky trap door to your attic? Yikes. So remember, I said this ladder's in the basement stairway. Oh, do I dislike this. There's got to be a better way. 100 amp panel. Look at how much room there is. Oh my gosh, look at all the open slots. Fields down... Field stone foundation. It's damp, but it's not wet. Furnace by oil, 1998. Gas for cooking. So you're already plumbed. Full workshop. Hot water tank. You do have good supports. I'm not seeing lots of problems here, but this is just uh, a blank canvas. Concrete floor needs a lot of love. Look, no dryer. You need to install one of those. Oh, and this half door. Oh my, I hit my head so many times on that thing, but at least you have access. All right, let's start out front so you can really understand the scope of the property. You're not going to believe you're in East Milton Square. It feels so secluded and this is the way the owner liked it it's an adventure look at we're heading into the depths of east milton square what will we find lots of hidden beautiful flowers i wish i knew more about them there's even yep there it is there's a peony there are roses there's climbing vines the outside envelope is in good shape this right-hand side of the house, this is where you would expand, though. And this is where the neighbor's house um, to the left also expanded. 
Okay, thanks for coming. I'll see you at the open.